Hello guys, we are back with a new experiment and today we're going to see uh, the effect of a pretty high electric field on the flame of a candle. So let me explain how we are going to achieve this high electric field. This is the uh, circuit diagram. We have uh, our input that is uh, the line voltage AC. Then we have a uh, very AC which actually allows me to vary the voltage from zero up to 300 volts root mean square. Then we have a microwave oven transformer that actually steps up the voltage by a factor of 10. And then we have this uh, voltage doubler circuit that uh, is going to help me in doubling the voltage and then also converting in from AC into DC. And then the DC voltage is uh, uh, fed into a capacitor uh, and uh, in this capacitor, we're going to place our candle and see and see what happens. So let me show you the experimental setup. You know, I really like experimental setup. So here you have this is the line voltage. This is the very AC auto transformer. Then we've got the microwave oven capacitor. Uh, and then we have our voltage doubler and also rectifier circuit. And here we have our um, aluminum plate capacitor uh, we have the plus sign on the uh, right plate and the minus sign on the left plate the candle is going to be placed in the middle like you see here and uh, uh, I'm pretty confident I'm going to reach a voltage difference between the two plates of uh, 2000 volts the spacing between the two plates is two centimeters and so this will lead to a, an electric field of uh, 100,000 volts per meter and we're going to see what happens now i'm going to turn on the, the electric field i'm going to gradually turn it on you see the capacitor still remains charged and so I have to do something to discharge it. <laughs> Incredible. Again. You see the flame is actually pretty attracted to the to the minus plate. Still remains charged. One last time. You can actually hear the, the corona discharge of the plates if I actually increase the voltage dramatically. Okay guys, I hope you have enjoyed this video. Ah, let me see if uh, the, the smoke is actually affected by, I mean, by an electric field, sorry. I'm gonna do something. Turning on the magnetic field now. The electric field, no, nothing. It seems not, but I'm gonna see the video again. Let me discharge the capacitor. See you next time, guys.